Hello again folks, it's Jim here from I Am With Jim. Now, I promised yesterday that I would do another video on how to set up some uh, trading view signals that get sent to your Crypto Hopper automated trading bot. So it will automatically buy and sometimes if you want to sell crypto based on your signals from trading view. Now this gives you a lot more flexibility than using just a trading bot on its own. However, I do like to use the buy signals alone on trading view and not the sell signals. I, I prefer to let crypto hopper decide when to sell something using the trailing stop loss because you can make more profits that way. Alright, so in today's tutorial or video I am going to show you how to set up uh, your trading view with where are the indicators there they go all right parabolic SAR it's called PSAR all right where is it where's the one I usually use Okay, it's 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 in my favourites somewhere. Right, PSAR. Alright, and where is the one I like? Mm. I think that's the one. Yeah, that's the one. Alright, ever get. Okay. Now what we're going to do is we're going to I'm going to show you how to set up your trading view so it will fire an alert like this one here and it will send a message to your crypto hopper to buy whatever coin you decide automatically all right it won't tell crypto hopper how much of the coin to buy it will just say buy this coin now all right so I'm just gonna have a look on this and see what kind of results are good on this time frame I'm not liking this time frame because I'm looking for at least 1% profit on each trade all right I prefer more than that all right, so let's have a look at the five-minute time frame. All right, and I'm just measuring what kind of results we can get. Okay, on the one hour, I'm thinking the one hour will be better in most situations than the smaller time frames all right so that's quite a good pump right up there 23 hours and okay yeah I'm thinking the one hour for this demo obviously you choose what time frame is best for you okay uh, so let's go with the one hour just for this demonstration now I've got my crypto hopper paper trading bot open and ready and I've just reset it since I made a video yesterday using this as well so I've just reset it and I've added a thousand fake dollars in there and I'm gonna now show you how to send messages from your trading view to your crypto hopper when to buy all right, and we're going to choose. Let's choose a. Hang on, I wanted this. Let's choose Bitcoin as the example. And let me just get that set for you. There you go. Okay, now you can see both. All right, so we're on the one hour. Now, in your paper trading bot, if you didn't see how to set it up, just have a look at yesterday's video 
and you'll know how to set it up so let's crack on in here we're starting from a blank slate so I'm going to go to marketplace and I'm going to go to apps here I'm going to scroll down I'm going to find the trading view one there it is I click on there and this is where we configure everything we need to configure all right so if I go back into here and I just choose my alerts and I get rid of uh, all the ones that I've used before We're starting fresh all right so we're on Bitcoin and we want an alert creating for the next time a buy signal is printed now this is the one hour chart but just to show you it buying I'm gonna put it on a one minute chart because we will get more frequent signals on a one minute and in fact I'm gonna to go to another coin to see if we can get an upcoming buy signal Maybe that's uh, not a good time frame. All right, maybe there's going to be a new signal on the five minute ape coin chart. All right, so let's go with that one for an example. But it's the same process for any time frame and any coin. All right, so what I first need is I need to. I need to copy this webhook URL now. I'm just going to reset this. To make it a fresh one and I'm going to copy this and then I'm going to go over to my trading view and I'm going to paste this webhook into an alert so let me full screen that and let me click on alerts make sure you're on the right time frame that you want alerts on all right PSAR select that there because that's this indicator and only once all right because it's going to buy one time only if you choose any of the others it will continuously buy to infinity every time one of these buy signals is triggered all right so now what we want is our webhook and we need to paste that into there all right so that's the same now we need one more thing from our crypto hopper which is this code here so let's say the code is going to be ape and we're going to generate hang on just put that on market and generate that and we need to copy this code here all right you can do it like that or you can just copy that so back to the alert on trading view and paste that code into there you can just give it any old name that you want okay now you can create that now that should be ready next time it prints one of these buys see we've had a sell there I think it's gonna print a buy very soon as long as this doesn't go down again too much and we just need to go back to our paper trading bot on full screen that so you can see it make sure it's all switched on yeah so it will receive signals okay so we go back to here base config and there we go buy settings check all that's switched on and go into the strategy settings here and we make sure that signals only is selected all right everything else is more or less as we want it so I've got my trailing stop loss will be activated at 5% with a drop of 1 so that means let me show you looks like we're about to get an alert triggered if it does I'll switch back to my crypto but quickly alright so what's going to happen is it's going to buy let's say a trigger goes off it's going to buy it's 
going to add that position in crypto hopper and because I've set it to 5% trailing stop loss that's going to be a 5% pump before it sets the trailing stop loss obviously this being an example that is not a good example but you can see there you could have had 1.35 percent in an hour and 10 minutes not bad at all actually all right back to I think we're gonna get another buy signal back to here so I can continue telling all right so let's say we put our numbers like that all right so once ape coin goes up two percent it's going to arm the trailing stop loss and that means it can go up to three percent and four percent and five percent but if it drops after it gets to two percent if it drops by 0 0.5 percent it will sell so the minimum we could expect on that trade should be 2 minus 0 0.5 so 1.5 percent or it could go up to 5 percent and then drop half a percent we might get 4.5 percent that's the cool thing about trailing stop loss it allows the the bot to follow follow the price all the way up as far as it goes like here's a good example all right so let's say it bought here and this could go all the way up to two percent which will actually go to 2.5 2.6 percent and then the, the trailing stop loss would have been activated at two percent so it would have followed it up from there and this is where it starts coming down so 2.62 percent is the highest that it went and then that could drop down to 2.1 percent which would be about here about there and then the bot would sell it all right for 2.1 percent profit and that's not bad in two hours 25 minutes okay are we going to get another buy? It doesn't look like it, does it? Have a look on the one minute. Right, we already had one back here. Look at the 15 minute. Yeah. All right, so it's all just a matter of timing. And anyway, as you saw in yesterday's video, we got one while I was recording live that came through while we were recording and we saw it buy and yesterday we were using the super trend indicator all right so let me go back to the dashboard let me make sure everything is switched on so that is now ready for this here reset the zoom on here okay that is ready for the next buy signal coming in all right so I'm thinking it should come around here or something but because we're on the five minutes it could be up to an hour before the next signal comes in and you don't want to watch this for an hour just waiting for that to happen but I promise you it will buy because we have that alert here already configured as soon as that alert goes off to buy it will ring the handbell like that and as soon as I hear that it means that my crypto hopper has bought a new position and it's going to be ApeCoin alright so 
Uh, I've left links below if you'd like to help support the channel. Uh, there are links below for Crypto Hopper, for Trading View, and for Binance. If you'd like to help me out by clicking on any of those links and signing up using my link at no extra cost to you, it would be extremely appreciated. It helps the channel out to no end. All right. So I really wanted it to print out a buy signal. I don't know. I think it's on going to start coming down and we won't get one for a while. But you just have to trust me. Have a look at yesterday's video dated the 31st of October and it should show you it buying automatically based on the super trend indicator all right so that's a nice quick one for today and I'll try and get you another one for tomorrow okay so I'll see you in the next video and happy hopping guys bye bye